three-point lead. Game on the line on this play. Ragland waits for the shotgun snap, extends the hands, catches the ball. He's looking to throw from the one. His pass. Intercepted. Yeah. To the end zone. Touchdown. Bearcats. Yeah. Yeah. Thomas has picked it off. And since... With that interception, Malik Clements put his fingerprint on the page of Bearcat history. Like many before him, these moments, sometimes the entire game, will be remembered by fans for years to come. Before the game Saturday night, the 2007 team was honored. This wasn't the team that knocked off number seven Rutgers, and it wasn't a BCS Bowl team. They may not have their historical moment, but they certainly have their place in Bearcat history. In first 10 win season over 50 years, I mean, I would say that's a pretty good, uh, pretty good indication that we were changing things. Haruki Nakamura was a senior and a captain in 2007, a team that had great potential, but first it had to overcome a coaching change. So I think the seniors on that, on that team, the juniors and seniors, they should be commended because when you get a new staff coming in, you really have to buy in, you know? And if those guys wouldn't have taught us to, to really buy in to Coach Kelly's uh, program and what they were teaching, uh, I don't think it would have been such a smooth transition and we wouldn't have you know, skyrocketed the way, the way that we did. And the season started off with six straight wins and all of a sudden a bunch of guys that no other BCS schools recruited we're in the top 25. You get a group of guys who are told they can't do something for for the majority of their lives, and you give them an opportunity to play for something. You know, it's it's that's 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 how much respect that we ended up gaining. You know, in, in the ways that we approached the, the the building process at UC. The year ended with a record of 10 and three and a victory in the Birmingham Bowl, but the table was now being set for years of success that included trips to the Orange Bowl and the Sugar Bowl and five conference championships in the next seven years. For me, I was a true freshman that year and um, you know, it just gave me a mindset of what college football really was, how to prepare myself every single day. Um, so going into the years coming, I knew uh, what it took to, to win, what it took to be a champion. Everything that they were able to do that year really did lay the groundwork and transition them into what was two really, really great football teams in 2008-2009. That being said, the body of work in 2007, that was a good team as well. We put we put UC on the map. We, we made sure that everybody understood that this is this this group's ready to, to you know make their make their place in the BCS game.